Get a little bit of milk. Mm. Keep away from me. Oh, Jesus Christ. Christ almighty. I can't see anything. Oh, I'm really uncomfortable in every part of me. Yeah, me too. It's really hard, that one. Okay, inspired by one of our favourite internet shows, Hot Ones. Woo. Today, Becky and I will be eating some spicy... What are they? Oh, they're Southern Fried Corn Bites. Southern Fried Corn Bites in exceedingly hotter hot sauces. <laughs> While also answering your terrible questions, because I requested questions and they're all dreadful. Yeah, they're not great, to be honest, everyone. Should we have our very first one? How are we doing one? this, then? Are we eating the entire thing? I say we eat the entire thing. We answer The entire thing? I assume it's all right. I think it didn't sink it. We have milk too. We're gonna try and avoid it. Not touching it. I'm gonna do this whole thing. I think I'm gonna have the milk. No chance. That was nothing, that. Danger taste explosion. More like nothing. Hey. <laughs> Question one, can you say hi to my mum? Becky, do you want to say hi to Jessie's mum? Hi, Jessie's mum. <laughs> can you do more vlog content? So I have been experimenting with this. Hopefully by the time this comes out, the Cog's birthday vlog should have come out. I'm not expecting the videos to do as well as the other things that I've been releasing, but I definitely want to keep trying to push that content a little bit more every now and then because it is really fun to record. At least one person's going to enjoy it. Yeah. <laughs> Me. <laughs> you enjoy it. Right, do you think we should have another one? I think we should. This one, it seems to have really soaked in in a way that the others. Yeah, you or can't, did you, you can't just see it at all. Forget you, to you can't Oh. Look at that. Oh, it smells strong then. What's this one called? Turn down the heat. Turn down the heat. Wasabi. Yeah, the first one was kind of nothing really, mm. in my opinion. I think things are really going to accelerate very quickly in this one. Yeah, I agree. That's delicious, actually. I'm doing like a thingy thing. Look at me. Any thoughts of proposing to Becky? What's your opinion on that question, Becky? I'm good, thanks. That sounds so hard. <laughs> I'm, kidding, I'm, kidding. I'm sure we're going to get married at some point, but we're just not bothered, bothered at the moment. At the moment. I think we're we, happy we where we are really. at the minute. So we have no rush to change that. I think there's other things it's, that yeah. we want to do in life before yeah. getting married. I never feel like it's a necessity or something that I've ever really desired to do. So we're, it's, we're not that bothered. I like getting lots of questions about it all the time, though. That's, it's that's, great. Yeah. That's probably <laughs> it's all I think about in all honesty. Every day I wake up and I'm like, I can't wait to get married. First impression of each other. Can you remember meeting me for the first time, Becky? I can. No, you don't. I've asked that multiple times before. No, you don't I, remember. It was our first day of college, so I, I was late into This is just my story, though. You don't remember <laughs> it. You just remember me telling the story. Just then I thought I had, so you just ruined that for me. I wonder if that's actually what did happen. You don't remember. But you it was won't. a long time ago. You came in late. It was a big deal for me because you were like like a hot girl that sat next to me, whereas I guess I wasn't a hot guy that you sat next to. Oh, you were oh, good, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know what to say to that. Will you ever come to Florida for a meet and greet or do any events here? Probably not a um, Jack Sucks at Life only meet and greet. would potentially go to an event in Florida. 100% that'd be incredible. It's just an excuse to get free ticket to Florida, isn't it? And then you can go to Universal and stuff. Yeah. We really want to go to Universal at some point. I think it's far too much stress and I also don't think there's the demand for a Jack Sucks at Life only meet and greet, but I would definitely attend an event if I was invited to one. When's the last time you cried and why? I can't think of mine, but I know yours. <laughs> it's a the sad bit in <laughs> first Ice Age film, actually. What happened, Becky? Tell well, me. Well, I think I was a little bit hungover as well. <clears throat> it's the really sad bit when Manny the mammoth sees the little pictures on the wall, and it's where his family are all happily playing, and then the people come and they they kill all his family, and it's really, really sad. Becky got really upset. Shall we have another one? Yeah. Quite a substantial amount on this. There is a substantial amount. I blame amount. myself for this. Mm, Becky was in charge of dabbing the mark. Good luck. What are we doing all in one? Okay. I've just seen how big my cheeks are. These are all absolutely fine so far. Mm, that's tingling my tongue, that now. It's a slow burner. I'm having this water, but I want to record that it's just because I get thirsty all the time, rather than I'm struggling, and water doesn't help spicy food anyway. You can see in camera two, neither of the milks have been touched at present. Push <laughs> Kai Ross Best, editor Kai, says, can I come over? Absolutely not. No, Kai can always come. No. Flossie and Kong want to meet you. Be nice to see his new car as well. Nice car, Kai. What special projects are you working on right now? We've got Christmas merch that we're getting set up, haven't we? We have. So it's all hopefully kind of coming in the next week or so. It's basically just a few things all together in, you could say, a form of bundle, perhaps. We're very excited about it. And it should be hopefully being released around the 25th of November, maybe? So that hopefully. it arrives in time for Christmas? As soon as possible, we'd like. So stay tuned. Make sure you've got notifications on because I'll do one of those like silly little announcement videos when it comes out. What are yours and Becky's favourite meals to go out and eat? Always Italian. Anywhere that's got nice food. I like Italian food. I think we really love pasta, pizza. <laughs> But I'm also a, a big, a big, a big fan of sushi as well. You okay? You're struggling. I've got it's a cold. It's nothing okay, to do with have the hot food. Just have your milk. <laughs> Go for it. It's fine. I'm no recovering one, from a cold. No one will judge you. Okay, so this is the fourth one in, and then we've got another five after that. The bomb mm. is the one that on hot ones everyone goes mental about. Mm. It's a slightly smaller dab. I'm worried about we'll that. See one. how we're feeling. Are you doing the all-in-one again? Nope. 
Mm-hmm. They're all exactly the same to me. Put a bit on your finger. I'll put a bit on my finger. What if it's just soaking in, you know? Whoa. No, it's a slow burner again. It's getting me now, but... Mm, when you have it by <clears> yourself, you can kind of feel it in your throat a bit more, can't you? Do you see yourself getting any more dogs or pets in the future? Far future for definite. Obviously, Flossie and Kong are like our entire lives, aren't they? They're just the best things in the world. Obviously, the only downside is, which obviously I'd much rather have them. It's just they're very, very tiring. Gotta go to the cinema with these two talking about. My sister's great. My sister and my brother-in-law, Colin, are wonderful. And they help out a lot, don't they? Future-wise, hopefully, it won't be for a long time. But when yeah, we'll well, Flo well, and Kong do, you know, die, which <laughs> will inevitably happen. I think we'll probably leave it for a while, just so we're not tied down. We can do yeah. more travelling and that kind of thing for a yeah. little bit, and then get more in the future after that. Maybe like a couple of like emus or something. I don't want emus, I want a uh, Rhea. Maybe I want an emu. I've won <laughs> Ask Becky to say silk six times, then ask her what cows drink. Oh she'll, my god. She'll probably say milk. Oh my god, Becky, say <laughs> silk six times. Silk, 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 silk. Becky, what do cows drink? Milk! <laughs> How has YouTube affected your relationship? Has it brought you closer or do you feel a little more distant? I've been doing YouTube the whole time uh, that, yeah. that we've been so in relationships. Yeah, so it's just, it's so just, just yeah. normal. You would not really thought anything different. If anything, it's nicer because if you had a job where you were getting back really late or having to leave early in the morning, probably not see anyone near as much of each other. No, very true, Becky. Do we have another one? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Are we, we on to the cycle juice? We are. Right, we're going to start dabbing scent. each one a little extra. Whoa, whoa! I want it to be fresh! That's the first one I can feel a bit of a difference mm. there. Yeah, me too. Quite hot, that. Gets you all around your throat, that one, doesn't it? <clears throat> I'm just thirsty. I'm not struggling. I'm just thirsty. <laughs> Do Flossie and Kong like each other? Becky, go. They do. At first, Kong is really mean to Flossie. Kong is a bit of a knob off the bat. If she was about to like jump up on the sofa, he would like run around and beat her to it. Stop kicking me leg! Sorry, right, I'll put God, it. God, you just sat there like this, I'm just sorry. over and over again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it took a few months and it took us like a bit of discipline from us to get him out of that habit. You catch them like cuddling every now yeah, and then. You, you like look over to them and they're like spooning each other. Yeah, they're lovely. And they look proper embarrassed when you catch them. <laughs> if one of the other weren't there, they wouldn't miss each other though. But they still <clears> like to be around each other if that makes mm. sense they would both equally be just as happy if they were only dogs when will there be a house tour look i'd love to give you a house tour but becky's been promising to put these toilet roll holders on the wall for months now and she's still not got around to it. no you haven't uh -huh. what about the one in the ensuite <laughs> let's add more you ready to add more we've only got four left at this point this is Psycho Juice, 70% Red Savina. <clears throat> it's called Killer Hot Sauce. You may experience pain. Do not panic. Pain facility is the release of powerful endorphins from within your brain. Oh, yeah. Endorphins make you feel good. Oh! If pain symptoms persist, do not lower your dosage. Just shut up whining and take your damn medicine. Bloody hell, who's yeah, that coming? Right. Are we adding extra on? Add it on, add it on. Nice, that was respectable for you. I'm going for it and I'm avoiding no. the lips. Oh, quite rough after you finish it that way. You know like when um, a dragon's about to roar and it's like glowing in the back of a throat? That's what it feels like at the minute. <coughs> a little bit of milk. I'm not touching it. Don't, don't mm. keep away from me. Silk, 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 <laughs> silk, really silk. Good. I would say I've passed over to uncomfortable at this point after that one. I'm fine though. <laughs> will you ever get a cat? Becky, will you ever get a cat? I love cats very, very much. They're incredible. <laughs> when I watched you say that, it's like someone was pointing a gun at you off camera the way you... <laughs> I love cats very much, young <laughs> Have you and Becky ever considered making a clothing line? Like, not just Jack Sucks at Life merch, but like a proper clothing line. That's kind of what I'm like aiming towards. I wouldn't say any of the stuff that we've sold, like the yeah. lovely beanies. It doesn't have Jack Sucks at Life written on it. It doesn't have like a Minecraft character on it anywhere. And you know, the lovely sunglasses and all those kind of things. I try to design stuff that people are going to feel happy and comfortable wearing out and about. <laughs> so that's kind of what we're doing on a small scale at the moment, isn't it? How are Flossie's feet now? They're okay. She's still on and off with her boots. We've also got a cone now because I like to give her feet a bit of a break from her boots. I and think I'm having shoes on too long causes little problems every now and then, doesn't it? Got a little cone on, so she's like a little lamp at the moment. Oh! Good girl! But she's doing okay. She's doing okay. But she seems happy, I think. I think she's the best she's been in a while. I'm gonna go for the next one, then. We're adding a bit of extra on. You know what? Let's so add a bit of extra. We're in the top three now, so I feel like this is gonna really start. My nose is running. Oh, thank you very much. You're very welcome. This is Spicy Little Number. Ooh, a, a spicy box. little number. We're gonna give a little dab. Spicy little number, this one. I'm gonna eat it quick, I think. No, you have to, you have to embrace it. Oh, Jesus Christ! There was immediate retaliation the second that touched me there. How are you doing, Becky? You're right. Very hot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it gets much, much worse. That's really, that's really. Oh, you're blue in my eyes. Sorry.
What's the best part of being a YouTuber? What's the hardest part? It's really nice being self-employed and being able to kind of work to your own schedule. Hardest part? This. Hardest part is to, yeah, having to do it. <laughs> do you like cheese and Shrek? They're my two favourite combinations. If I could think of two things that are my favourite things in the entire world, it would be those two things, but it'd be in the other order. It'd be Shrek then cheese, I think. Why Shrek first? Because it's... Incredible. <laughs> well, Becky, how do you feel about Jack having dozens of play buttons and not giving you a single one? I find it satisfying enough just watching the little wall fill up. Yeah, that's my I, thing. I live here as well. So every time I come in, there's always another one. And it's she like... can come and look at them if she wants to. Maybe I'm Turd Boy. Turd Boy. Did you see that one coming, did you? <laughs> that's a plot twist, that one. <laughs> Has Becky ever considered editing your videos? Becky did actually edit Cog's birthday vlog, and I was very impressed. No, it's nothing special. It's the first thing I've edited since I did like some incredibly half assed pretty <laughs> film studies thing. But I've really enjoyed it. It was Ooh. really, really good fun. I was really and impressed I'll, with I'll how I'd be, be up for um, helping out if there's anything else. I think for vlogs type things where you kind of have to be there in order to know how best to edit them, I think Becky was perfect for editing the video that came out the other day. Oh, it's the bomb! So if you've not seen Hot Ones, the bomb is the one where all of the celebrities being interviewed just kind of have a proper breakdown. And we really struggled on that previous one. Yeah, I'm really, really, really stressed about this. I can smell the heat. I'm really gonna struggle with this. Yeah, I think this could be really difficult, this one. Three, two, one! Holy shit. I'm okay at the moment. I don't move in case I trigger something. I know if I cough, it's gonna get so much worse, but I, there's just, my body wants me to cough right now. <coughs> oh. You alright? That's severely painful, I think I'm gonna throw up. I brought Jenny's casserole dish in case that was to happen. Have you seen my eyes? <coughs> I'm crying, there's literally tears coming out of my eyes. If you could choose any profession in the world for Flossie or Kong, what would you their jobs be? I'd like them to both have really popular Instagram accounts because it would be a really easy way to make money. Cook uh, food as well for uh, us. Cooking and food would, would be slightly less re- I'm What are you really doing? <laughs> You've made things fall off me shell. <laughs> me blood! <laughs> I can't even describe how horrific this is. There's so many tears coming out of my eyes. If you want children, can't think of anything worse. What about this? What about the bomb? I'll have the bomb a hundred thousand times before I have children. Sorry, Jack's parents, if you were wanting grandkids. Not from us, I'm afraid. Oh, my stomach hurts. I can feel my stomach not being very comfortable now. Uh, what YouTubers do you watch? The Sidemen! Yeah, we got quite into the, the Sidemen channel videos a bit. They're pretty solid. Retin Link, good mythical morning. Retin Link, when there's nothing else to watch, we'll happily dip back into Retin Link. I think they're great. When you first started YouTube, how did people react when you told them you had a channel? My parents didn't really understand it. I don't think they 100% do at this point. I've got severe pins and needles in my hands. <laughs> <Is that part laughs> Why? Of, they just suddenly came on. I have no idea. Like, That's severe. weird, that. I hope you're alright. Of course I am. What's that for? It's weird, though. That's weird, that. Do you get pins and needles when? And eating spicy food. As if that worked. Yeah, so it does happen. Oh, there we go. It's not a question, but can you tell Becky she was a great waitress at Panetti's as she served me a couple of times? Where are you, Becky? I can bring them dishes. Yeah, you can. <laughs> are we doing the last one? Do the last one. Look at you doing the thing that Sean Evans does. It wasn't this even is surreal. So this is Wiltshire Chili Farm. Fearless flavour. Trinidad Scorpion. Oh my god, it's got five chilies and it's extreme. So it's supposedly worse than <clears throat> the bomb. Add a little bit extra on Becky. I'm fine now. Right. It's all them. Um, Christ almighty. Jesus God. She's melted. I thought that. it would be a dab rather than a pour. You've drowned that little fella, Bex. Right, we'll swap. You can no, have no, this no, one. No, 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 don't put any more on yours. I yeah. want to last dab mine. Oh god, but it's so soaked. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to do it. No, me neither. <laughs> Three, two, one. Dab it. Quite nice, though. It has a nice flavour, that one, in the way that some of the others don't. That was fine. Right, you know what? We're doing a Paul Rudd. We're getting a little selection. We're putting them all together. Trying it out with my weird, disgusting, slurpy noises I'm making, Kai. I can't help it. No, 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 no. Gotta have some of them. Make sure that, you know, a bit of snot comes out my nose. Why am I looking at the microphone when I'm speaking to Kai? <laughs> what? That's not Kai! I could get a little picture of him and put his face on. Yes, <laughs> he's lovely, isn't he? He's alright. Right, we've mixed all nine of the hot sauces, including the bomb, into a lovely big. You gotta get a good splatter. That looked so <sighs> visually appealing, that Becky. That was nice. So I feel like there was quite a bit of the bomb in here, so I'm not feeling good about this. Fine little fella. When you were little, what was your ideal job? For quite a while, I wanted to be a food taste tester. Mm. I mean, still no, I love food. When I was a kid, just food. My tongue's really hurting. What about you? You know those people <laughs> that find out how someone died? Like the body on the table. Forensic scientist. Yeah, whatever that's called. I wanted to do that for a bit, and then I, um... <sighs> I developed a phobia of blood, so it wasn't a good mix. 
<coughs> the bomb's right there. So it wasn't a good mix anymore. And then I wanted to be a vicar for a bit. And then I stopped believing in God, so that wasn't gonna work. And then I just wanted to do stuff related to film, like being a director and stuff. Kind of related to what I'm doing now. You had much higher aspirations than me. You would have nailed me to food taste tester though. Not for hot food. It's really horrible this. We've done it though. No milk. <laughs> Couldn't have done this without you, mate. I can't see anything. Oh, I'm really uncomfortable in every part of me. Yeah, me too. Ah, uh, you plan on going to on tour someday? At this stage, I have no idea what a tour related just to me would consist of. It sounds like a lot more stress than I could be asked with, so no. But that's not to say that that won't change at some point in the future. You know what's around the corner, do you? You know what, Bex, at the end of the day, you don't know what's around the corner. Favourite Disney princess is Mulan. Mulan's by far just incredible. Since I was a kid, I just think she's unreal. That's as many as Twitter wants to load the question. So I reckon that means that we can have a drink of milk if you fancy it. Can we? Yeah, do you want some? Okay. You did it, Becky. I'm very proud of you. Me too. That's very refreshing, that. I just think that Sean Evans is absolutely phenomenal, isn't he? If you've not watched Hot Ones, go watch it. Yeah, because I think he's he a really wonderful the interviewer. The best interviewer ever. The questions they come up with are just great. And you can tell from the guests they have on just how refreshing it is for them as well. Yeah, it just feels like mainstream media and TV chat shows. It just all just feels very superficial, whereas I reckon they kind of make some proper connections and stuff like that. Show. Could have done with him asking us some questions, really. Yeah, most of your questions were garbage, Would it be nice guys. That? No offence to you. Just all kind of the same stuff. Okay. <laughs> I think I'm all right now. I think I won that. How did you win that? What did you do differently? <laughs> Thanks for watching. We did it. It was a lot of fun. Not looking forward to, to, to tomorrow now. Thanks for watching. Please click that like button if you enjoyed this kind of stuff because it's a bit different. And also subscribe as well if you're new. Please do because that hurt. <laughs>